if this video gets to 1,000 likes, I will make this my new Roblox avatar. So make sure you guys like the video and subscribe if you guys want to see this. Hey yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video and in this video we are here back inside of Build-A-Bo once again and today we are actually going to be making our very own damage candy inside of build a -Boat. Yes, you guys heard that right. A candy that actually will make players oof if they actually eat it. I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to get this thing and it's gonna be insane so make sure you guys stay tuned and also make sure you guys like the video and subscribe. Not only am I gonna show you guys the death candy in this video but I'm also gonna show you guys a bunch of other custom candies that you guys can make inside of build a boat trust me you don't want to miss out and like i said make sure you guys like the video subscribe and without further ado let's go ahead and hop straight in and oh no i just realized i said if my last video got to a thousand likes i would make this my my roblox avatar so i guess i have to do it and here it is guys oh my goodness what am i doing what am i doing oh my goodness why 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 am i doing this well, so you guys, I said I don't actually change my Roblox avatars to things. Well, you guys can see right here. This thing just costed me 400 Robux. And what in the world is this, bro? What have I done? Oh, no. But the rest of my video is going to be this right here. Are you kidding me? Now, let's go ahead and get into the death candy and build boats and some of the other custom candies that you guys can make. This is going to be very interesting. Now, I'm scared when I'm using this avatar now. Like, this thing looks absolutely terrifying. All right. So, right now, I actually got my... My girlfriend Isabella still if you guys want to see an Isabella face reveal make sure you guys get this video to 2,000 likes and if it gets to 3,000 likes she will start her own YouTube channel you guys heard it right here right now okay so Isabella come on over here because I've actually got a huge surprise for you there's this new candy that's inside of the game that's uh not a lot of people have so don't don't actually eat it yet all right Isabella go on over and you know just stand right here and just try to eat this candy and see what happens okay you can see it even changes colors it looks amazing amazing that's a nice looking candy right there oh she just died um uh, isabella how did that happen how did that happen well that is because i've actually set up a system now guys this system is not that good to be honest you can make this even better where you can actually make a candy that looks like you can actually click on it and stuff and if you actually press this lever it will actually push spike blocks over them now i actually kind of made this a little bit weird so when you actually activate this it activates like only like one of them i'm not too sure why I think I glitched it out made the pistons and everything but this is what it originally looks like so Isabella I'm sorry you got pranked but basically what happens is there's actually a switch here that actually covers up like the click on it so whenever someone's about to eat the candy now like I said you can make this a way better system the spike blocks actually go across and do damage now you could actually do multiple rows of this so and let's say I actually wanted to make more rows so I'd actually go like this duplicate these and push them up but the only problem to that is that you can't really anchor pistons so there's definitely workarounds that you could do to make this even better but you can make your own custom death candy and build about which is insane so let me just go ahead and demonstrate real quick how this works with all of it on so isabella go up to it like just like how you were and go ahead and click this lever and you guys will see that like should go to eat the candy the candy's actually underneath there and then the spike blocks actually do damage you can make this so it actually covers the entire plot or even just a certain space it all just depends on where you actually want this to be located at on your plot now i actually want to go over some other custom custom candies that you guys can do and it's actually gonna be kind of weird to do these custom candies because of my avatar type so it's gonna be very interesting to see here so if you guys don't actually know inside of one of the previous updates we actually had in build about true throw made it so you can actually customize candies inside of the game and you actually have the grow candy and the shrink candy and oh yeah you guys can see right there just got massive and now she's tiny so <laughs> It's kind of funny to play around with, but they've actually added settings onto these. So you can actually turn on the certain scales to make them do some crazy stuff. So if I wanted to just customize this one, you can customize it so you get smaller. And bro, look it. Wait, this actually works with this. Like my head got bigger, but my avatar got smaller. Let me try one of these. So if I use my property tool here and I do grow head scale, let's put this on one. And if I eat this, you guys will see, I am now giant, but my head is super small. <laughs> that is absolutely hilarious. Isabella, do you like like my head now is my, does my head look better why are my shoes so big all right let's try this again let's do another custom candy this time i'm gonna do a a one on the head scale actually i'm gonna do a two on the head scale and then a one on everything else and let's see how ridiculous this is about to look all right let's go ahead and eat this here and find out bro what the heck uh 
<laughs> what? Hot dog, she says. I, I don't even know what this is anymore. What is wrong with my avatar? This is absolutely hilarious. And there's some more you can do as well. So, for example, you can do like a normal avatar here. But this time, we're going to do width scale just to one. So, everything should be normal except for the width. And look at this. Bro, what the heck? I'm like a flattened hot dog. All right, let's see what else you can do with this. All right. Grow height scale. Let's do one. Just like that. Width scale, let's do one. And everything else at a two. All right. This is going to look ridiculous. Bro, actually, wait. Yeah, that kind of looks a little bit weird. I can't lie. I still look very weird. I don't know if it's just me or just this avatar. But still, everything about this is cursed. All right, Isabella. Why don't you go over here and try this candy? Hold on. Not yet. Let me go over and make it um, a really nice looking candy. All right, Isabella, go ahead and eat this candy right here. And tell me what you think about it. All right, let's see. What does she look like? Just a small head. Oh my gosh. Wait, why? That looks so weird, bro. Okay, now I'm going to try it with the smaller candies. Unfortunately, you can't actually customize the pink candy or any other candies that will probably come inside of a future update. But here we go. Let's go over here and try uh, the blue candy right here. Let's do shrink scale. Let's set that to one and then head scale one. And let's uh, let's see what this looks like. Actually, I mean, it still doesn't look terrible. And Isabel's just eating all my candies right now. What the heck is... You just ate my candy. Look at you now. Look at you now. Now you just look weird. All right, hold on. Hold on, let me try to eat the same candy here. So let's do width scale. Let's do one and then 0.75. Let's see. Oh, wait. That wasn't it. That definitely was not it. I just got smaller and like more fat. Bro, what is happening right now? But yeah, if you guys are wondering how to actually make the death candy look like as realistic as possible. uh, Well, basically, you actually want to make the switch transparent, make everything around it transparent and also put the candies inside the middle. Now, there's also a trick you guys can do with the candies to make them really cool. I recommend doing this because it does look pretty sick. So put one to 75 transparency just like this. So and then we're going to take another one turn this one to 75 percent transparency transparency uh, just like this and we're going to actually slide this one inside of this right here so now you can see there's like like a purplish one now we're gonna take a yellow and we're actually going to make this thing 50% transparency so we're gonna take this we're going to drag it inside of the pink one and now you guys can see it's actually getting brighter and what is Isabella doing she's placing blocks on me for some reason and then we're gonna take a 75% actually no we're gonna take a 25% purple one we're going to slide it inside of here just like that and now you guys can see you have like a translucent candy that flashes that is honestly super cool. Isabella, what are you doing? This is my candy you're building on right now. What the heck? I am an angry hot dog right now. Get off my property. It looks so silly. I don't know why in the world I bought this thing. The only reason why I switched my avatar to this was because you guys liked the video. Bro, what is she doing? Is she stealing my candy and about to launch the boat? Wait, what the heck is this? This is just robbery right now. What in the world is she doing? I have no idea what's happening, but I know, I know the solution. I just launched the boat and she doesn't know what to do. She doesn't know what to do. I gotta eat my candy. Gotta eat my candy, my candy. No, I'm good. See you later, Isabella. It was nice knowing you. That's what you get for trying to steal my candy. But if you guys did enjoy the video, make sure you guys like and subscribe. Turn on that notification bell. And I'll see you guys all inside of the next one. Peace out and goodbye.